When was the last time you had a conversation with your children about sexually transmitted diseases? Local health officials in Jackson County are seeing a big jump in some STDs, mostly among young people. And as Fox 47's Megan Heiler explains, they aren't always easy to detect. Sexually transmitted diseases are on the rise in the United States and Mid Michigan is no exception. And health officials tell me that the increase is enough to be worrisome. And we're seeing this increase in gonorrhea cases that we haven't seen previously. Our rate went up 72% from 2016. So that's a quite an increase. Jackson County Health Officer Richard Toon says that the county has been seeing an increase in STDs over the past few years. He says that oftentimes young people who get the infections are simply being careless. We just don't think people are paying attention to the prevention message. We have a clinic here. Uh, sometimes we see the same people. When it comes to the state average for gonorrhea, Jackson actually falls below it, but that isn't the case when it comes to other STDs. Chlamydia, we're actually higher than the state rate is right now. We've been that way for a number of years. Well, it is alarming. We never like to see an increase in the rate or the number of cases of disease. Experts say that the rise is happening not just in mid-Michigan, but all across the state. In the past year, the amount of chlamydia cases has gone up by 9%, with gonorrhea cases jumping up by 22%. We have been seeing a rise in gonorrhea and chlamydia, especially in the young population, especially in the like 20 somethings. It's really been on the rise, so we've been seeing a lot of cases of it. And the increase can cause problems down the road, especially for women. And then they have blocked fallopian tubes and they have uh, damage to the internal organs and to the uterus. And so then later they have fertility problems and problems conceiving their babies. Experts say that the best way to protect yourself is to practice abstinence or use a condom. Symptoms for gonorrhea and chlamydia often can go unnoticed, so it's important to get tested regularly. Now, as Fox 47's Megan Heiler reporting, for a list of gonorrhea symptoms and to find local testing centers, visit stdcheck.com.